Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jay from JS Films. In this video, we're going to be checking out Rodin Texture 3D Model. What I'm going to be doing right now is generating some 3D props that we can import in Unreal Engine for Fortnite or Unreal Engine 5. So that being said, we are here now on the webpage. Now, we can either import an image or use text to 3D, which that's what we're going to be doing right now. So right here, I'm going to click Text Input, and I'll just say Old Rusty Metal barrel and what I can do here is just kind of refresh until I find something that I like all right I kind of like this shape so I'll just click on the check mark and we'll click on generate now you can do redo and have it kind of generate different variations if you want to change it up so we'll try this until I find something that I like now once you're happy with the shape of your model you can go to confirm here. Now you can choose the polygons you want. Uh, in this case, we're going to be doing UEFN. So we'll go with 10,000. And it's going to ask you, is the object symmetrical? Yes. And then once that's done, you can go to generate right here and select the PBR temperature. I'm going to set this to about 7. I'll hover over here so you can kind of see what that's doing. It says effects, complexity of detail in PBR. And the reference strength right here. I want it set to 1 because I want it as close to this image as possible. And then once that's done, I'll click on Generate right here. All right, so we have our rusty barrel. And once that's done, you can either redo it or confirm. I'll just say Confirm right here. That's going to finalize the material generation. Then next, what we'll do is select what we're going to be exporting. Now, this is going to be going to Fortnite. So we're going to do Base Model, OBJ or FBX, doesn't really matter. I'm going to do PBR and then 1K Textures and I'll just click on download. So what I'm going to do now is generate some more 3D props, and then I'll import them in Unreal Engine for Fortnite. All right, so here we are in Unreal Engine for Fortnite 5.4. Now, again, you can do this with Unreal Engine 5. It's the same exact way. I just created new folders and imported all of the 3D assets that I generated using Rodin. So I went a little bit crazy. I generated one, two, three, four, five, six different ones. And what's cool about this is uh, UFN actually automatically nanites objects. So as you can see here, we pretty much text the 3D model to nanite, which is insane. And I actually have this running in game as well. So if I switch over here in Fortnite, you can see all of the assets that we generated using just text to 3D. I generated six of these assets in less than 20 minutes, which is again, pretty insane. And what's impressive is, it actually has the writings on the gas. You know, sometimes with AI generated things, it just makes random words up. But for being in beta, this is pretty crazy. As you all know, I've made some previous ones before, uh, previous apps. I, I would have to say, even as just 1K textures, this is looking pretty promising. So that being said, that's pretty much it for this video. Let me know in the comments below what y'all think. If you want to know more about this technology here, check out the link in the description. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out.